Teledyne Fleur Defense's Black Hornet for Nanodrone has won the U.S. Department of Defense's Blue UAS Refresh Award. That may not mean much to the average person, but it does give us an excuse to talk about the Palm Size Infantry Recon Helicopter. It may have a passing resemblance to a toy helicopter, however, the Black Hornet 4 is anything but. It's the latest generation of the Norway-based Teledyne Flirt Defense's Black Hornet family of nanodrones designed to be used by infantry soldiers to sort out the lay of the land without sticking their heads out into danger. Weighing in at only about 70 grams and with a rotor diameter of 190 millimeters, the Black Hornet 4 can be assembled and launched from its carrying case in under 20 seconds. It can fly at 10 meters per second for over 30 minutes on a single battery charge, and can handle wind gusts of up to 55 kilometers per hour, which is reassuring to anyone who's seen their lightweight drone going sailing off in a gentle breeze. Controlled from a small handheld unit, the Black Hornet 4 has a radio range of 2 kilometers and secure communications links thanks to encryption, dynamic power, and frequency jumping functions. It also has a certain degree of autonomy for beyond line of sight operation and in GPS denied areas. It has inbuilt maps, collision avoidance, and can even follow a virtual string line to keep it on course around tight corners, including in urban areas, trenches, and buildings. It also has a high degree of stealthiness with low visibility and low motor and rotor noise. Exactly how quiet is to excuse the pun, a bit hush hush. The Black Hornet 4 has what is claimed to be the world's smallest thermal camera, a 12MP electro-optical camera, a navigation camera, and a white LED lamp. Video feeds are at 1280 by 720 pixels, snapshots at 3024 by 4032 pixels, and thermal imaging video and snapshots at 512 by 640 pixels. Evaluated with 35 other UAS systems, the Black Hornet 4 was one of those chosen for the Blue UAS Refresh Award, which means it can go on for National Defense Authorization Act and cybersecurity verification before getting an authority to operate certification to work with U.S. armed forces. Along with having already been selected for the U.S. Army's Soldier Born Sensor Tranche 2 program, this latest achievement will make Black Hornet 4 available to an even larger cohort of users.